What's up Team Buckhouse, Jonathan Buckhouse here. And in today's video, I'm gonna walk you guys through your first day back on snow for the season because I just went over my longest break of the season. We didn't ride for a month and a half. And so I'm out here day one back and I'm a little washy, a little like slipping out, falling a bunch. And so I'm gonna give you guys all the tip that I'm taking today to get back in like ready for the ripping on the daily or like a couple weeks or a couple times a week type. You, you, you know what I'm saying. Okay, so day number one back, the first thing is don't be too hard on yourself. You haven't snowboarded in a little bit. You gotta get your feet back underneath you and the best way to do that is to make some turns. You know, get out here, you know, S turns, get understand what it feels like to, you know, like make those turns again because it's gonna feel a little weird and you might, you know, catch an edge a little bit or slip out or, you know, have a turn give out on you and you know, you're spinning like crazy on the run. It happens and that's totally okay. Like be fine with the inconsistencies that are gonna happen. Next, you're probably gonna get a little tired, you know, like my legs and my feet, they're like burning a little bit more than they have been because I haven't been doing this consistently. Those muscles have been re-woken re up. They're like, oh man, okay, we're doing this. Here we go. So don't be afraid of taking more breaks on your first day back. You know, you need to, you know, let your feet rest a second. I've been unstrapping my bindings and like kind of giving my, like my boots, like letting my feet breathe a bit, get that blood back into my feet. So I'm not like having the most nuts and saying, foot pain while I'm riding up the lift and things like that. So there's just take those minor breaks, stand like, like literally while we're filming this video, we're taking a break, you know, laying the legs kind of get it back before we do another lap. The next tip is like, don't go for your end of season level day one. You know, if you're spinning massive jumps or hitting all these features or doing all this stuff end of season, it's okay on day one back to not go right into that. Now, if you are feeling it and you're feeling good, go so obviously go ahead, but don't try to rush back to your end of season progression from the year prior, because you might end up getting hurt trying to do that day one of the season, which would be horrible. No one wants to get hurt day one. The other tip, and I really think everyone should do this, is snag an evolution sticker. You don't want to start the season off not rocking, letting everyone know that you're a part of Team Up Gals. All of the evolution stickers, all of our merch is linked down below if you do snag it. It's how we do this for a living. It supports the dream. So thank you so much to everyone that does and has. And we'll continue to snag evolution merch, guys. We appreciate you so much. If you do snag it, though, tag me on my Instagram. I'll give you guys gear and sticker shout outs in the vlog. The other thing that might happen to you on the first day of the season is forgetting gear or forgetting stuff. So slow down, like do a double, triple check before you drive two hours or an hour or however far it takes you to get to the mountain. Double check, you have all of your gear and then eat a good breakfast. You don't want to show up super hungry, missing your gloves, all the stuff, getting frustrated, you know, like slow down, like be like the snow's not going anywhere. It's the first day of the season. Like you might be so amped to get back out that you might make your day worse because you're just rushing, rushing and doing so much stuff. And then the last tip, the last thing to think about on your first day back on the mountain is snowboarding is literally the most fun thing on the planet and skiing, this applies to skiing. So get out here and have fun. Don't beat yourself up. Don't be too hard on yourself because you're not riding at the level you were the last time you were snowboarding. That is okay. We're out here to have fun, smile, have a good time. There's literally no reason to not be stoked sliding down snow on a plank of wood. So with all that being said, Timo Gals, I hope this video helped you. What are your tips for early season day, first day back, stuff like that? Comment those down below. And as always, Timo Gals, thank you so much for shredding with us today. And as always, thanks for watching. Keep evolving. We'll see you tomorrow in another video because it is daily on this snowboard channel.